Hey guys, welcome back to another vlog, another Hello. video. This is the first video I'm gonna it post. It looks ready. I just woke up. Oh yeah, he still has to get ready. We're having our gender re reveal today. I literally still have the tag on this dress. I still don't know exactly what I'm wearing. We're going to find out what we're having. If it's a little freeze or a little Bushra. A little fluffy. <laughs> a little fluffy, I guess. Um, but I'm still trying to figure out what I'm wearing. I have so many options, but I don't think I'm gonna go with this one Even though it looks so nice because we're gonna do like powder and this dress was kind of expensive And I don't want to get this dress ruined, but it's so nice like so cute got it from Veiled Man, can I get some more blonde? A little bump update that I've been hiding from you guys. This is how I hide it Let me get some Bolani too. You want some Bolani for Go eat some Bolani Freed's mom made Bologna. This is the second outfit option, which is the one I think I'll go with because I don't care if it gets ruined really. It's from Forever 21. And then I got this um, underneath thing from Amazon. I'm trying to figure out what hijab color to wear. Freed was telling me to wear blue. So this is this like neutral E one. I have to iron these, but this is the blue one. I guess I'm team boy now. <laughs> I do think it's a boy, but I... I don't know. I don't know. We'll see. This is the brown. I also had these two dress options, but this one's from Bashenko. And then this one from Turkey that I got. But I don't think I'll wear those. I'm not going to try them on. So cute. Don't drop my blanket. So the gender reveal don't is done. We are at the movies now. What movie are we watching? We're watching Bashenko. Doctor Strange. Doctor Strange. Thank you. Maybe I got the blankets. Movie is done. It was good. Did you guys like it? Yeah, I did. I liked it too. <coughs> I need to watch the first one. I need to watch the first you one again because I forgot. All right, let's go watch it. So Maybe got some down. popcorn, Disney. courtesy of Nabia. <laughs> we, got, we got popcorn. If we had the Tesla, we could just watch it right now. Uh, on the way back, <laughs> Nabia's like watching and driving. <laughs> Good morning, y'all. It is Sunday. Today, as I'm filming, I feel like I did not do a really good job vlogging yesterday at all, but I have like a whole separate video of the gender reveal side. Like, I was trying to film like a separate vlog for you guys, like a weekend in my life. So this is what this vlog is, and then I will be like uploading a whole separate video for the gender reveal that we did, which I am so excited for you guys to all see. That will probably be coming like right after this video or maybe like a few videos later, I'm not sure. Let me know. If you guys really want to see it next, I'll upload that one next, inshallah. Just let me know in the comments. But I feel like I did not get to like catch up with you guys at all. Um, I barely like vlogged anything yesterday. But it is um, Sunday today, like I said, Mother's Day, which I know it's like Mother's Day every day, but I'm just currently getting ready. I'm still at my parents' house. We'll probably go for like lunch or something later today with my mom. This is like the first vlog I'll be posting since like I told you guys the news and stuff and it feels so good now that you guys know like I've kept this to myself for like five months. Um, a lot of you guys seem to be confused with how far along I am. I'm five months in um, as I'm filming this video today and I'll be uploading this video like probably like tomorrow or the next day which is crazy. Like I can't believe it's been that long. And I even told like my family and friends, I didn't tell them right away either. I kind of just told them like a little bit later. I was like processing it myself, you know, um, but like my parents and stuff knew. A few of you guys in the last video I just posted, the reaction video, which I posted that yesterday. Um, Y'all were asking like, where's Vanessa's reaction? Because I had her in the thumbnail. I didn't even think anyone would notice, but I guess you guys noticed that like she was in the thumbnail, but I didn't have her reaction like in the actual video. It was because I like screen recorded her reaction and then I like um, didn't realize that it doesn't like film audio because she was like the first person I told and so um, that's why I didn't post it because there was like no audio to it but I'll go ahead and like insert her reaction right now but there will be like no audio to her reaction but you guys can watch that for those of you that really wanted to see her reaction there just won't be any audio so as you can see <laughs> it's really funny though she was really surprised and I called her on snapchat because we were like snapping each other and then I just like called her then and I was like you know what I'm just gonna tell Vanessa I like could not hold it in any longer I needed to tell one other person I actually told Vanessa before I even told my parents or sister um, so she was like the first one to know after Fareed yeah that's that video so for those of you that wanted to see her reaction there you go there's like the muted version because stupid screen recording it does not get like the actual like audio i did not realize that till her video so then when it came to other people that i like facetimed and stuff i was like let me record it with my camera and then like 
you know, just like record me FaceTiming them. I wish I did that with Vanessa too, but I unfortunately did not do that. Yeah, also I just want to say I'm so grateful for all you guys and your like sweet, sweet words. And, like you guys are all so kind and sweet in like the two videos I posted. And I'm like trying my best to like respond to as many people as I can, but it's really hard for me to like get to everyone and it gets really overwhelming. So if I didn't get back to you on that um, first video I posted, I'm really sorry. I'm pretty good at like responding to your guys' comments. So I feel like some of you guys were like, hey, you didn't respond to my comment. I'm like, there's just so many like I was getting overwhelmed but thank you so so much and I appreciate all of you guys and thank you for all the love and the support it really means a lot and it's crazy um like now that you guys know like it feels so nice such a relief I literally vlogged all of Ramadan and I was like okay how do I go about like vlogging this and then like not having you guys catch on because I wasn't fasting so in the beginning I was like oh I'm not fasting and why am I like always sitting like this I have problems I have like a hunchback um, but I think you guys just assumed I was on my time of the month and then I was like, you know what? I'll just go with that And then I was like, let me just like not mention the fact that I am fasting or not fasting for like the rest of the weeks And then um, I hung out with Nabia one day and we were getting food and stuff because she couldn't fast that day So then I was like No, well, I might as well just like vlog us like Because that's what we're doing like we're just eating and stuff So I was like, okay, I'll just say I'm not fasting and then you guys can assume what you want And I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys assumed I was on my time of the month But yeah, that's also why I like never recorded iftars or anything like that for the most part because I wasn't fasting and I didn't want to like pretend like I'm fasting and like record myself opening my iftar and stuff like that so that's why I feel like the vlogs could have been better if you guys knew yeah that's that reason I feel like the lighting keeps changing the weather is like kind of weird today it's like really windy outside so I don't know like I have like a tree right in front of my window so the like tree is just like going back and forth and I feel like that's also what's changing the lighting um, now time for my favorite mascara. This one can be a little clumpy, but I kind of like that look. Um, it's the Essence Mascara because I have very, like, small eyelashes, I feel like. So I'll take all, like, the volume <laughs> that I can get. Let me try to fix this lighting. Why is it so dark? I hope that lighting got a little bit better. I don't know if that helped or not. I'm just gonna do my mascara. I still can't believe you guys know. Like, I'm just like, ah. It is now starting to feel more and more real. Now that it's, like, finally showing, I feel like I have not been showing, like, the first um, four-ish months. Like, I feel like I barely showed at all, so it was, like, really easy to hide from you guys, I feel like. Um, I did feel like I was, like, really bloated all the time, but maybe that was, like, me showing, you know? But I don't know. It didn't feel like a bump. It just felt like Blow. In terms of like content and stuff, are you guys interested in seeing like a how my first trimester went, how my second trimester went and stuff like that? Well, I'm still in my second trimester. I think I'm almost done though or about to be soon. Not soon. I forgot when. Till how many weeks is your second trimester? Because last time I went to the doctor, she was like, oh yeah, you're in the end of your second trimester. Um, I don't know. I need to... I'll figure that out next time I go to the doctors. Do you guys want like those videos or is that just something like boring that you wouldn't want to watch? Let me know because um, I can do that if you want or if you're interested in my experience. Um, I loved watching those videos when I first got pregnant just to know what to expect and stuff and it made me feel like less alone with how I was feeling and things like that. So let me know if that is a video you would be interested in seeing. If you're not interested in seeing that, I won't do it. Um, just let me know in the comments. I do plan on doing some like morning routine, night routine videos. I feel like I haven't done those in a very long time and I love doing those videos or I love watching those videos more than anything. Um, I just think it's fun to see like everyone's routines and stuff and yeah. One thing I've been experiencing, which I mean it's like something on and off with me anyways, like my skin issues and problems like I feel like I finally got to a point where my skin was like finally clearing up and then it started breaking out a bit and then eventually like I kind of like got it under control it started clearing up again then the second I found out I was pregnant um it was clear for like the first uh, like few weeks and then out of nowhere my skin just mm, took like a whole turn and it has been breaking out so bad I don't know if you guys can see like these little monsters right here it's not fun I hope it gets a little bit better but that's been an annoying pregnancy symptom but is it really a pregnancy symptom well it's also like I can't use a lot of the skincare products I was using before because of like you know pregnancy and stuff um, a lot of skincare products I didn't even realize are just like not safe for pregnancy it like says that on the back of the bottles and stuff and like you can't use like a retinoid or a tritonian or anything like that so can't use a lot of stuff sadly so I'm like what, what do I do about this maybe I should like clean up my diet a bit more that'll probably help you know I drink a lot of water and stuff like that but sometimes it's just like hormones and 
can't really do that much about it. I really hope it gets better. I feel like it's kind of calmed down a bit. It was like really really bad like three weeks ago. It was like at a peak. Right now I feel like it's calmed down but then I have like these two really big ones right here. And then I have like these tiny ones right here and then my forehead's been like a little bumpy. Um, or like I'll just like, I don't know. It's really annoying. It's not fun. Like my skin is definitely one of those insecurities for me because I just um, it's not fun. If you deal with acne, you know. It's, it's just not fun because it's like your face and like that's like what everyone sees and then your skin's just breaking out and it's just like someone's talking to you and then you can tell they're just like looking at your breakouts and it's like not fun. If, you'll de if you deal with acne too, I see you. I feel you. <laughs> we can get through this though. It's not like permanent, you know? You can, you know, it gets better then sometimes it gets worse again but I definitely have like very acne prone skin unfortunately and every time I think it's getting better it comes back which is so annoying I honestly thought I was like oh I'm finally over the acne now I just have to deal with the scarring and stuff and then boom I started breaking out again and the lighting just keeps changing <laughs> but it's okay alhamdulillah otherwise as long as the baby's healthy and everything's good alhamdulillah you know there's so much more to be grateful for than to like complain about my skin and also before anyone says like oh it's probably the makeup's not helping trust me i have tried like not wearing makeup for like forever and i feel like my skin was still like the same because i have dealt with this for a while in my life like on and off and i don't think makeup really does anything as long as you take it off at night clean your brushes which i religiously clean my brushes and stuff i do not think the makeup really like contributes much to my acne honestly i don't think it does anything anyways i am now ready i guess i'm probably about to head back out towards my apartment and stuff back home because my mom and my sister and stuff will be out there we are all going to go to lunch in that area so i'm gonna be leaving my parents house now gotta go pack up you know some food and stuff to take <laughs> Shout out to my mom, she always like loads me up with some food every time I come back home which makes it really easy for me and for Ethan, I'm so grateful for my mom for doing that because it just makes it like really easy throughout the week just to like warm up the food she made and it also tastes way better than any food I would make. Yeah, I'm gonna go figure out what I'm wearing today, I'm not gonna wear like this sweatshirt, I just like threw this on right now. A little update, me and Fareed are now out. We're gonna go get some lunch with my mom. It's really cold out today, I don't know why. Or like, it's just like super windy and cold. Um, so, I layered up. I got like a really warm sweater and then I put this on top. Happy Mother's Day, Mama. Thank you. Fareed, you didn't get your flowers. <laughs> you didn't get my mom flowers, Fareed? <laughs> <laughs> we tried. <laughs> They didn't have any at the store. Dude, they ran out. <laughs> so I'm back home now. You can see the little entry basket and stuff in the background because I did my laundry at my parents' house. Every time I go back, I'll just like take a load of laundry or something. So I do need to like fold that up and stuff. But today's been like a very chill day. Kind of just like been relaxing, been back home for a while. To be honest, I do need to start cleaning up around here a bit. I do want to do that. It's also finals week, or not finals week, but like finals are about to happen pretty soon. And I do have some stuff I need to get done, like schoolwork though. I need to like work on that kind of stuff. Also, like I just went on to my YouTube and I was like looking on there and I was like, oh my gosh, we're so close to 40k subs. So like, uh, I don't know if we're gonna hit it before this video. Like by the time you see this video, I don't know if we're at 40k already, but if we are, Thank you guys so much but yeah if you're new here hello i forget that like new people join like i mean i see that like new people are subscribing and stuff but like i don't know why it just doesn't click in my head like i feel like everyone who's watching is like the same people who have been watching and then like sometimes you guys will ask me questions and i'm like oh i mentioned this in this video or something but i'm like wait if you're new it makes sense you know y'all like none of my clothes now fit me like i'm literally wearing um like, I mean, I'm wearing my jeans, right? But, like, obviously you can't see because, like, the sweater is pretty loose and stuff. And, like, I just wore a loose jacket on top. But I did not, like, button my jeans. I'm just, like, wearing them as is. Like, I cannot button them. Like, my stomach is too big now. I'm like, how did I fit into these jeans before? It's just crazy, like, with the way my body's changing and stuff. And every day it's, like, different. I was, like, looking online for, like, maternity pants and jeans, but I can't find, like, ones that are, like, this loose fit that I like. I don't know, but also, like, once summer comes, like, once it actually gets hotter, I won't really even wear jeans that much. I'll probably be wearing more, like, loose flowy pants and, like, dresses and stuff, so I'm like, do I really need to get maternity pants or maternity jeans, you know? So, 
We'll see if I end up getting them. I honestly don't think I will because I can't find a pair that I like. And I'm not just going to get a pair just to get a pair because if I won't wear them, what's the point? So there's that. None of my clothes are fitting me anymore. And it's kind of getting hard, which is why I've been like wearing like the same outfits over and over again, if you guys cannot tell. But I mean, there's nothing wrong with that. You know, why do you have clothes? You know, like wear them. Um, but I am going to end this vlog off here for you guys. Do let me know any video requests you have for me. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!